Hello everybody, my name is Sulit and welcome to the Power Grid. We're going to continue on with episode 3 of Dragon's Dogma Dark Arisen. Now in the last episode, just a quick recap, we defeated an evil... What is it? I think it was a Hydra or something. It was a four-headed creature. And we also went down into the well to defeat some alligators with spears. I know, crazy, but it happened. So if you guys want to check that out, make sure you guys check out the annotation or rather the YouTube card. It's the I button that appears whenever you hover over the video. And yeah, so we're just going to go ahead and continue on with episode three here of Dragon's Dogma Dark Arisen. So without further ado, let's get into the game. All right, here we are. If you notice, I do have some different characters here. Our main pawn here now is Marco. Uh, reason being is because I restarted the game over. A strange power emanates from within. Because I saw there was a hard mode, and that was a requirement of hard mode was to restart the game, and so I did. And so here we are in the same exact spot that we left off. We'll meet at the. Okay. So we're going to regroup with Sir Mercedes, and what she wants us to do is to deliver that snake head that we chopped off to some duke or some leader over at a place called Grand Sorin. <laughs> okay, these are the first, uh, these are the first human enemies that I've encountered. Oh, that was awesome. Gotta go. That guy has a pretty sick ass weapon. Oh, oh my god. Oh my god. That was intense. What was that? Oh, wolves. Hello. Oh no. That thing, like, got in the way. Wow. Marco is strong. Oh, hi. <laughs> Where the heck did that thing come from? It looked like it came right out of the bushes right there. Oh, more. Okay. Come here, then. Dang. Oh, my goodness. Am I really on hard mode here? I was having a hard time getting to this point. And it looks like we're having an easier going time. Yeah, I'm on hard mode. Slay them one by one. Where? Who? Die. Maybe I've just gotten that much stronger with actual weapons and not those rusty pieces of crud that they gave us to start off with. It's because I bought a lot of things. Oh, look. We just completed the quest for slaying wolves. Oh, giant coin pouch. That's what I love about being on hard mode. It's because a lot more money comes out of everything. Nice. Oh, there's coins. Oh. Are they... What? Oh, wait. Is that a pawn or... I can't tell if that's an enemy or not. Ha ha! Ha ha! Okay, I think that was a pawn. I'm letting you go. All I know is hard mode makes it a lot more difficult for you to play because your stamina consumption is greatly increased when you're using a move or just running. Also, HP reduction huge huge hp reduction when you get hit you made it good we make for the capital men like as not the cart will draw beasts along the way stay vigilant but fear not we walk with the arisen slayer of hydras ha ha i see there's a rift stone there what can i do with that protect the cart all right, let's go. Let's do this quest. Once again, this is the 
quest where we have to take this thing to Grand Soren. And, uh, yeah, keep it safe. What happens when I kick him? Oh, it makes him go faster. Stop. Oh, he just, like, ran over the goblin. That was awesome. Ooh, look at this giant coin pouch. Giant coin pouch, yes. I don't have anything to take them down. Oh, this sucks. Okay, get it down, Ben. And women. Here we go. We got one. Yes, here we go. Last one. Last one. Can I throw a rock or something at it? There we go. Yes. Oh, okay, that didn't do anything. I can't really throw too high. Come here. Oh, crap. Did I just, like, hit the... Oh, look at that. Giant coin pouch. Nice. There we go. This guy already. Yes! Come on. Come on, wolf. Alright, I need to get that coin pouch. Oh my god, each giant coin pouch is 10,000 gold. Oh, whoa, whoa! What the heck? Look at my health. That is from one hit. My goodness. Something odds of use up here? Oh, holy crap. There are people in here. Okay. I'll just take your things, and I'll be on my way. What? Oh, there's nothing up here. It would have been cool for them to hide something here. Alright, let's go catch up with the people. My god, everybody got killed. Get up, guys! Oh no! The cart is almost dead. Holy crap! What do we do? Whoa! That thing just spat out a large coin pouch or a giant coin pouch. There we go, nice. Oh, <laughs> I guess I can. Hello! <laughs> oh my god, there's a lot of them. Oh crap! There. Okay, sorry about that. I accidentally hit a wire and kind of almost broke it. Anyway, we're back. No, stay away from the bison! Get out of here. Oh my god, I'm dead. Wait, I'm getting healed by the bison, yes! Oh god damn it! I couldn't see! Yay, we did it! Alright, can I get a heal? Oh my god, Marco. He just did that. Oh, shoot! Well, that was close. Good thing it missed. I would have probably died. Oh, here, here we go. Yes! Move! Here we go. Come on, get cured, Bison. Yay! It actually worked. Oh, here's another one. Oh my god, this is awesome! Bison's getting cured up. Yeah! Are we there yet? Those guys don't look too friendly. Kill this range attacker here. Any more? Oh my god, I got hit once with that move and oh my god. Look at my HP. And that is why they call it hard mode, folks. Hard mode. I'm gonna ride the bison. 
go, Bison, go! The Duke's burden is great. Between his Duke okay, this didn't make it any faster. Oh, I didn't mean to do that, Mercedes. I'm sorry. You think that they'd be super offended that you just picked them out of nowhere, but it seems like they're okay with it. I think we're safe now. Says the guy with a monocle. Done men. And women. A Hydra's head is a fine prize. His grace will be pleased with the cause work. Walk proud through these streets, men. We are heroes to the people of Grand Sorin. Yeah. Heroes. Good. Rest up, men. Please. She likes to say the word men a lot. I'll make for the castle directly to offer my report to his grace. I'll have words sent for you, friend. Pray sojourn in the capital a while. To the castle, men! Step lively! Yes, may I help you? Ah, fortune smiles upon me. Well met, sir, at his end. I am called Mesa, if it please you. Now you're come to the capital a conquering hero, you'll be needing aught to do, eh? Yeah. Give me a quest or two, please. My word to you? Begin with the pawns. Inquire about them here in Grand Solid. Their kinds woven tight into the fate of the Arisen. If you know your destiny, know them. I feel more familiar with this quest now. Okay. The items you receive have been distributed to you. Your main pawn and item storage. If you've mistakenly lost or sold an important item, try checking the Curiosity Shop in Grand Sword. Curiosity Shop? Oh. Huh. Oh, good to know there's such a shop. Ooh, we found the inn. Oh, hey, it's Madeline! Do you have my money yet? How good to see you again. You remember me, yes? Madeline? Yes? Yes, I remember you owe me a thousand coins. You'll find not but the finest wares here. No, I want to talk about the loan. Oh, maybe she has another thing of baleful nails. She does, but I really don't want it. No, she doesn't. Never mind. It's sold out. Hmm. Oh, that looks ridiculous. Oh yeah, in my previous uh, episode, I didn't really get into too much of the buying nature. So, I'm going to show you guys what you can do inside the buying menu. First of all, we got curatives, tools, materials, other, all the way down to jewelry. What you can do too is you can buy directly into your pawns by pressing right bumper like so. So if you want them to buy something and have it in their inventory, you could do that. You don't have to buy it and then change it and then put them in their inventory and like yada yada. It can go directly in their inventory. So it's very useful. And you can buy anything for all of your pawns here. Anything you desire. Also, there's a combining mechanism in this game. And I'll go ahead and just do that. And that might take a while, so I'll be right back. And we're back. Let's see what we can do for a quest. Are you the Arisen the men of the core speak of? You have a plainer air than I'd expected. Why, thank you. I appreciate that. Ah, forgive me. I spoke poorly. I simply imagined the sort of figure pulled right from legend. 
pray, allow me to begin anew. I am Asala, and this is my inn. Though we deal in a number of trades here. I hope this is the first of many visits, sir. I am at your service. Oh, you wish to learn of the Pawn Legion? Oh, yes, I do. Then the shortest path to the answers you seek leads west from here. There you'll find Grand Soren's Pawn Guild. It is a gathering place for their kind. Just tell the sentries you have business with the guild. Okay. A pick, any you like. Thank you, sir. What will it be today? Okay. We have so much discipline. Let's go ahead and learn some new skills. Be right back. Okay. Come again, sir. I got a lot of new skills. Really good skills. I'll show you. Here we go. My main character skills. I uh, upgraded his X button to the next level up. And since we're wearing a ring from the DLC, it actually upgraded it to Blitz Strike. Oh my god. Huh. Wait a minute. Has it always been like that? Blink strike, burst strike. Oh, awesome. So it actually made it go up one higher level because we have the swordsman's ring equipped. And I can only imagine the same thing for Marco here. Yeah, it's also Blood Strike. Nice! Yeah! Oh, look at that. And he has all his skill uh, slots put in there. He's got a Heaven Ward Slash, High Side Slash, Shield Drum, Shield Storm, Sheltered Spike. You'll see all that in action later on. Hopefully, I can show you. But anyway, let's go ahead and get going with our quests. What is this? Escort Raynard. I don't have time for that. I think we're supposed to be going to... Uh... Here we go. Visit the Pawn Guild. Let's go. Is this guild? So this is the Pawn Guild. You can summon pawns as necessity demands here at the Pawn Guild. How do I remove this stupid thing on the bottom of my screen? Well, nothing I did was able to get rid of it, so, oh well. Harpy hunting, yes! 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 Alright, we got a bunch of quests from the notice board. Welcome, Arisen. We have awaited your coming. This pawn is called Barnaby. I tend to the affairs of the Pawn Guild. Refer to the third person than the first person. Make up your mind. The guild serves as a place of rest for pawns, and as the gate to the Everfall. The Everfall lies beneath Grand Sorin. It is a place of great importance to our kind. But for now, let us rejoice in the coming of the Arisen, the light that guides the Legion. All right. Okay, what do you want us to do? It grieves me to burden you, weary from the road as you must be, but I fear trouble brews. I would beg your assistance in this matter, Arisen, if it please you. Okay. You have my thanks. Oh, okay. Where are we going? Hmm. I don't like the looks of this. Basement. Beyond lies the Everfall, an ancient place that sleeps beneath Grand Soren's stones. 
We pawns have long served as keepers of the entrance to this place. But since the dragon's coming, a strange aura has filled the Everfall. A presence. If it be some omen of evil to come, we cannot allow it to go unchecked. I ask that you seek out the cause of the change, or some proof of what's happened. The Everfall is a place unique unto itself. This is not a simple task, nor a favor I ask lightly. Which is why I ask you, Arisen. Please, lend us your aid. Okay, I'll help you. Let's go check out our other quests first. And why am I so dang heavy? Current quest is Lure of the Abyss. We are feeling ways upon my chest, Master. A foreboding. What is the definition of queer exactly? Let's do it. Oh, it's dark in here. Oh, my God, I forgot to give you guys... Oh, that's too bad. I forgot to give them a lantern. There's only two lanterns in the party. Which actually isn't too bad. Not too dark in here. This is the Everfall. Do we forever fall? Oh, hey, look at this. This, uh, this place sounds pretty ominous. <gasps> Holy crap! My heart just dropped to my feet. I thought I was gonna fall. What's that sound? A zombie? Oh my god! I barely damaged it. Hey, get off Marco! Oh my god. Ah! What the heck? It's so difficult to kill these guys. Why? <gasps> oh, it might have been a mistake for us to go in here. We're not strong enough. Damn, die. Why is it so difficult to kill these guys? It would be a mercy to destroy them. Mm. If you lose your way, you need but What's what what's she doing? Why does that sound so bad? What is that? What's that sound? Okay, die. There we go. I'm gonna save because I don't like the sound of that. Oh. Ah, they can't get me. Come, follow me. Oh, okay. Look at her, so knowledgeable. That's really cool about this game. If a person whose main pawn has actually gone through this quest before, they gain knowledge of the quest itself, and then they will lead the party over there, which is really, really cool. Whoa, whoa, whoa! That didn't do anything! Nice, we leveled up. Oh my god, I died. Oh, it's so difficult. Good thing I saved. Oh my god, can you imagine if I didn't save where we would have we would have ended up probably all the way in the beginning? Let's not miss this time. 
Oh, look at that. That thing is actually very powerful against them. It just killed them instantly. So make sure you use your environment when you're in the, any kind of battle. It might just save your life. Oh. Walking bones. I am here. Please don't overdo it. Hmm, what's that? I shall restore your health. Hold on. Any more bones? Oh crap. There was a fighter too. Oh, not again. Oh, Jesus. Anyway, we're out of time for tonight. So thank you all so much for watching. I'm going to continue this game tomorrow. Uh, I am assuming this quest is going to take quite a while. So I don't want to go over my time here. So once again, thank you all so much for watching. Make sure you leave a comment down below. Let me know what you think of the game so far. If I'm doing something wrong, what should I do to make it right? Make sure you leave a thumbs up if you liked it. And also don't forget to subscribe. And as always... My name is Suli, and I will see you in the next video. Bye!